It is almost the final countdown here for Trey 250. However, today we got you covered with Trey 249 here on the Tower Suite Chaos. So thank you for joining me. Appreciate you tuning in. As always, down below we have the timestamps. As I like to say, we break down the four T's, the treasures, the team, the tactics, and the toppings for you. And what I like about this particular series is we do iterations. I like that we can keep going and I call it try, try, try again. And you get to see a little bit of that real-time action, as I like to say here, as we pull together the right team, if we don't get it first try, which we do sometimes. So um, with that, uh, I just want to say thank you again for tuning in. Let's go ahead and make our way here to tr Chaos Tray 249, which is why you're here. All right, look at these. Um, so first off, defense cookies, no bueno. Support cookies and ambush cookies as well. So we got to think about kind of some of the different tactics and the teams that we line up. We'll talk about this one that we have here that we'll run with. Now, enemies, here's what we got. Cursed Sword. We got cursed blade and cursed sword so what does that mean typically that means inflict um so or injury so we got to pay attention to that the one that's going to help us there is pv so luckily we have access to pv here um, to remove injury on our team now what we are going to do is run kind of what i call the double header defense strategy what this is is this is taking two beefy tanks like pataya dragon and our friend capsation cookie here and splitting off some of the uh attacks so that holds the base if these ones aren't going across over the back you can generally protect your attackers and you can generally focus damage or focus heal. I always like to say focus damage, focus heal and new heal on your front liners, essentially create, creating survivability because you don't have to worry about trying to keep everything alive. Um, however, we'll find that out if that's the right strategy as we progress and as we run into the enemies here with these cursed blades. Um, so that's what we're going to run here. Now, in terms of the treasures, a couple key pieces, we are focused on attack um, damage here with Old Pilgrim Scroll, more with Dream Conductor's Whistle, and then Squishy Jelly Watch for cooldown. Now, instead of some of these things, you can use, certainly use Sleepyhead Jelly Watch. You can use more uh, crit if you want to go that path. You can also run attack and defense if you need to. Um, if we're running into problems with our big baddies in the front, you can split the difference here and make them survive even more um, with, with the Squeaky Flamingo Tube as another example to give you some ideas on how to overcome this particular run. Now, in terms of toppings, if you have more questions, do let me know. Um, I just want you to be aware that we have a ton of great topping guides for you here on the channel. If you got more questions around these particular details, absolutely check those out. Um, here we are on um, Solid Almond for damage resist. Here we're on Raspberry Attack because it improves uh Pattaya dragons damage resist now don't forget to put things on resonant toppings we're not always on resonant toppings but absolutely do that here we're on resonant we're actually on defense um you can consider going on attack here if you want to um here we're on cooldown see we got resonant there but we're on on cooldown and then additionally with pv we're on cooldown so that is really kind of the tactics um that is the team those are the treasures and the toppings so let's go ahead and make a run and see how it goes for chaos tray 249 let's go all right so as you can see all focused on the front in that first hit additionally we do have the injury here to pay attention to and again still focused on the front so nothing getting hit in the back so our split strategy is working. That also helps in case you lose one of your frontliners. All right, we got the big blades. Here we go. Ooh, they do some damage. They do some damage. We'll call that three star, my friends. Even though we don't need to keep all our cookies alive, the strategy worked out great for us. So let's go ahead, and I don't think we're going to be able to go back because I don't have enough keys i'm so sorry so let's talk about this here again so as we kind of conclude today's episode a couple of the key points um we broke down the tactics in terms of the cookie consideration and i like to pull that up as we kind of walk through the team because you can obviously change some of these ideas as you're pulling your your runner cookie teams together we gave you some of the concepts and the ideas uh with the curse swords which exactly is what happened Big damage there towards the end. Also, if you're already low 
um, as you move in there between the injuries and health, those things are definitely going to get you. So pay attention to that. We left that second line of really, really good damage dealers there with shiny and moonlight and then PV focused on those big heals. So, um, good things to pay attention to as you kind of build your team. Now I do recognize that this is primarily legendary and primarily epic. They're super epic cookies. Um, certainly hopefully you can do it with higher skill level, um, epic cookies or those kinds of things all skip by but this team will obviously get you there and i am free to play so um with that said questions comments let me know what team did you do did this one work for you as well and lastly i just want to say thank you thank you for tuning in as always appreciate your support thank you for the likes and the subs on top of that we got memberships so thank you to all the members as always and other great ways to support the channel down below so check it out um you never know and with that other great ways to stay connected and up to date on everything here and cookie run kingdom with that i hope you enjoyed today's episode and we have a ton of great stuff here until next guide until next time we got a lot of things going on shorts all kinds of fun um as always i love art so um let me know what you think many of you've asked please feel free to send them my way love to spotlight all right here we go enjoy chaos trade 249 we'll see you soon at the top my friends take care